Roger, tell us what it means to win the OVC Media Award. It really means a, a lot coming from the peers in your league, Rob. It's a, a, a real honor and a pleasure to be considered alongside people like Brian Nielsen and Neil Bradley and Mike Paris who have won the award and you build so many good relationships in this league and it's just a, a, an honor to win the award. You've been doing this for a long time. Are there any one or two games in any sport that you've done that stand out in your memory? Well, there's some there's some great games. Of course, Jacksonville State football game here, the last game of the year, where Tech cost them a OVC championship, came from three touchdowns uh, behind in the fourth quarter to win. I guess that was probably the biggest memory. Had a big basketball win at Murray State at one point that uh, um, was was very big. So it's just a, just a lot of fun. You mentioned some of the year cohorts uh, in the media around the league. You guys have a great rapport. We do, and everybody's been doing it a lot. Not only in the uh, in the radio media, but you have a lot of uh, TV folks you meet as well as the print media. It just seems like it's the same guys every year. They're all hard working. That's what makes it such a big honor to, to win an award like this. You talked about some of the most memorable games. Uh, you've also called games in some very memorable places. Any one or two venues pop into mind? Well, no doubt about Rupp Arena. When you when you think uh, basketball, that's one of the places. Had a chance to go to Kansas uh, to play in uh, in their arena. Uh, of course, been to North Carolina. Been to most of the other big ones. Still some, you know, that I hope we get to go one day, like uh, Duke Cameron Indoor Stadium. It's just uh, a great atmosphere for for sports, and you know, maybe that'll come in the, in the future. How about football stadiums? Football stadiums, no doubt, uh, I enjoyed Auburn. Uh, it was just a, a wonderful experience going down there and playing in front of 80,000 people, just uh, uh, one of the, the great ones. And then you think about the history of a place like Georgia and all of the, uh, all of the different history uh, making people that have played there, Heisman Trophy winners, Herschel Walker and the like, and that was another one of the big places. A lot of great people around the league that you work with, but you're also uh, following in the footsteps of some very well-respected media people at Tennessee Tech. I am Gene Davidson, Eldon Burgess uh, for years, did the radio, of course Frank Lane who was recognized uh, uh, with this award as, as far as uh, the service award uh, the first time it was presented. Um, just some of the great people, of course, you and your staff, uh, everybody who uh, has helped, you know, it, it takes a, a team to, to have somebody to win an award like this and with the work you all do, I know you, I give you grief at times, but you all do such a great job. It's, uh, it's, it's you know, and all of the SIDs across the league do, you know, they uh, you, we try to do as, as fair as a job we can. Yeah, we want Tennessee Tech to win, but, uh, you know, in the end, we want to be as fair as we can and, uh, you know, represent things as best we can. Roger, congratulations. Thank you, Rob.